What was Baby Mango like the first time I met him? Oh, have you guys not heard my Mango story the first time I met Mango? No, that's a funny ass story too. I gotta do this more often, chat. I gotta do my just sitting here fucking talking streams. I don't do those enough. I just, I just didn't think I could do it without alcohol. <laughs> but apparently I still got some improv in me when I, even when I'm not drinking, that's crazy. The first time I ever met Mango, so I had heard of him through rumblings in SoCal, right? People were talking about this new kid named Mango, who was supposed to be really good, up and comer, plays Jigglypuff. You know, like the way I reacted to Mewtikin, the same way I reacted to Mango. I was just cocky shit, who was like, who the fuck is this guy? I don't know who he is, so... <laughs> you could, you know, you could beat the other kids in SoCal, but... Don't even worry about me for a couple years, kid. Yeah, after hearing about him, then he beats my own crewmate. So I had I had the best crew in Southern California, in my opinion. But all of us had been top 10 in SoCal at some point, with me being the best of the crew. And we let Easy and Jay join us. And that was his tag, Easy and Jay. And then, you know what? One day he finally actually broke through and he made 25th in Southern California. You're probably laughing, you're like, haha, 25th? That's not that great. No, but Southern California, was easily the best region in the world at that point in time. Like, the whole world. So to be ranked in SoCal was a big deal. We were deep. So he made 25th, and we're like, cool, cool, cool. He's stepping it up, and he's really uh, starting to rep us. This is dope. And then this kid named Mango ends up beating him at Mango's very first tournament. So, of course, we were cracking up. We were ripping on our friend. He's in our crew. He got ranked, he joined our crew, we let him in, and what does he do once he finally breaks through and gets ranked? He loses to a person at his very first tournament ever. Oh, we were cracking up. And uh, I find out it was Mango, I was like, oh, okay, so this is the kid everyone was talking about. And then he beat Easy and Jay. Well, Easy and Jay kind of sucks, but that's still kind of impressive. Like, that's still pretty good. So uh, I'm like, okay, all right, all right. I'm, I'm, I, I wanna see this kid play. I wanna see what this is all about. Uh, so I go to my first tournament where he was at. This is the first time we ever met. And I think this is going to encapsulate our relationship and Mango as a person. Uh, like, you're, you're going to hear this story and you're, you're going to totally feel like, yeah, that sounds exactly like Mango. This is when Mango was 14. I think he was 14 at the time. So I show up to the tournament. At that point, I was ranked second in SoCal behind Ken. So I show up and I'm the best player in the room. That's what it was. I show up. And I go into the garage and that's where everyone's doing their friendlies and shit. And there was this guy named Fabian in SoCal. Fabian was like just this grinder, like up and coming. He was trying to be good, but he was kind of like a goof and we all kind of ripped on him. We, we made fun of each other a lot back in the days. But so this is what happened, right? So we were at this tournament and then he's like, oh, what's up, Hugo? Oh, dude, you got to check out this guy, Mango, man. He's so good. We're going to play teams. We're going to win the whole teams tournament, dude. I'm so good at team. He's one of those people that wasn't great at singles, but thought he was really, really good at teams. And he could have been. I think he was decent at teams, but I also think he was just teaming with really, really good players. So in this case, he was teaming with Mango. He's like, bro, we're going to win this whole fucking thing, man. Like, it's going to be so sick. And then uh, I was like, oh, really? You're teaming with Mango? He's like, yeah, dude. Oh, we're going to win the whole thing, bro. And I was like, oh, okay, okay. I was like, yo, Mango, do you want a team? And then he's playing friendlies, and then he, without looking, Mango goes, who is that? And then someone was like, that's Hugs. And he's like, yeah, I'll team with you. <laughs> and then Fabian goes, oh, that's fucked up. And then like he just completely got dumped, didn't have a teammate for the rest of the tournament. And then Mango and I teamed. So the very first time I met Mango, we teamed. And <laughs> he was literally just bragging about how happy he was that he was about to team with Mango and how well they would do. Oh, that's fucked up. And we were just cracking up and uh, we did win. We did win the tournament. We actually played in the bracket and I beat him in that bracket too. But uh, he was good. He was still hard and he, you know, it was, it was a challenge, but I still, I definitely beat him at that point. But uh, no, that's grind PR for sure. Yeah, the, if you guys don't know what the grind PR is, the grind PR, it's like a ranking, except instead of ranking people on skill, you rank them on how fucking grimy they are, how messed up they were to other people. Typically in a in a fun way that you could laugh at right like true like like Awful shit. You don't put on the grind PR. Those people are just terrible people this me stealing someone's teammate right in front of their face That's not terrible That's good-hearted fun. That's what friends do That's what we do
Hey, Mango, do you want a team? Mango, without even looking, didn't even see who it was, never met me in his life, just goes, who is that? And then someone else answers, oh, that's Hugs. And he's like, yeah, I'll team with Hugs. <laughs> <laughs>